Love. It's what makes a Subaru a Subaru. We're back on White Mountains today, and we're getting funky and eating some great food with Caitlin McGrath of McGrath's Tavern. Funky because you guys, in addition to having great food, like to party. We do. Uh, Us McGrath's love to party. <laughs> so. And it's amazing that you're even here because you guys have been slammed this vacation week. We have. And to get a restaurateur up this early to appear in a live morning show, that's a, that's a tall task. I used to be an office person, so I'm the one that's up early. But <laughs> Yeah, you, you took the bullet for Seamus this morning. You said, I did. I'll go into the morning show. Exactly. <laughs> um, so I asked you a couple of questions because I'm always interested in trends and what's mm -hmm. happening. Um, what has been popular in the world of food at McGrath's? Um, our fish fry on Friday nights has been taking off like wildfire. Um, it's $15.99, and it's a giant piece of fresh beer battered fried haddock, mm, haddock. Um, with coleslaw and french fries and homemade tartar sauce and all that good stuff. Um, and we've been selling out of it pretty much every Friday. Mm. People come up on Friday nights and they try and get there as early as possible to get it. Um, we have a couple- Will it sell out? It will. Normally, every Friday we are sold out of fish pretty early, so um, it, it just flies out the door. So mm. it's, and it's good and we like to keep it fresh, so. Yeah. It's a nice piece of fresh And it's haddock. Anytime I see like fish fry and I get excited and then I see it's like some weird fish from yeah, like no, it's, Polynesia, I'm like. <laughs> it's not some no-name fish. It is it is haddock every time. Um, and we do keep it fresh so that it's it's extra good for you. <laughs> Excellent. So that's Friday nights. And then you also have something on Sunday that's been popular. On Sunday, we, we're doing a roast pork loin on Sundays. Um, and it's, again, fifteen ninety nine, And it's, you know, served with mashed potatoes and vegetable and usually some type of sauce or gravy on it. Um, and it's not that dried out pork loin that you're used to, you know, grandma made and, and you never really wanted pork loin again. Um, yeah. It's it's nice and juicy, it's fantastic. So that's been flying out as well. That sounds good. How would you describe McGrath for someone who's never been there before? Um, even though we are an Irish pub, you know, like our family is, you know, deep into the Irish heritage, um, we have stuff for everybody. Um, it's a lot of American cuisine, burgers, we have great pub food, yep. um, and we have a little bit of some of uh, everything for um, someone who's like a picky eater. Um, we, you know, and we make everything in house so we can kind of doctor some things up if you really need something uh, very plain for a picky eater. <laughs> right, and the McGraths, they have a story that basically started here in the Wide Mountains with your parents. They were members of ski clubs yeah. and met each other. <laughs> so they really like, your whole family grew up in like the the kind of the ski tourist mode. So you know what yeah, ski tourists we were, like to uh, eat. We were those weekend warriors. We were up here every weekend, Friday night, drive, you know, packing the car and driving up here. Um, and we know what it's like to have to, you know, find some place to eat on a busy vacation week and a busy Saturday night. Um, so we try and get you through as fast and as, you know, seamlessly as possible. And um, it's it's great. We we enjoy seeing everybody that comes up on the weekends or just comes up for once in a while and we end up you know, every year if they come up once a, once a year, we see them every year now, so it's great. Yeah. You see a lot of people uh, like in that line of traffic heading into town for dinner time during mm -hmm. February vacation week. Everybody just thinks, well, we got to go back to the strip in North Conway. Little tip, you can avoid the traffic, you can avoid the wait, just go to McGrath's Tavern. It's right kind of where the traffic line ends. Exactly. We're kind of like that first pull off, so yeah. it works out really well and you can get an ice cold beer way ahead of everybody else. So. Yes, and you're so close to Cranmore, Attitash, Wildcat, mm -hmm. um, so you're kind of right in the middle of ski country it's right great. there. It's great. We have great ski options up here. So. And I'm going to give you kudos and a, a big plug because a couple of weeks ago, it was a Saturday night, it was very busy, and I didn't want to cook anything. I just wanted to get takeout somewhere. And I called around, and no one would do takeout on a busy Saturday night. I called McGrath. I was like, yeah, sure, no, no problem. Have it ready in 15 minutes. We, yeah. I got a burger. My wife got a, a delicious salad. You guys have great salads. We do. They're huge too, so it's nice. Uh, so it was. We, we were both happy, and I literally got there. Seamus was like, hey, how's it going? Here you go. And I was out the door. Perfect. So. McGrath's Tavern for takeout. Yep, and our menu's online, so McGrath'sTavernNH.com. That's a beautiful website, by the way. It is. It's a, it's a wonderful <laughs> website. <laughs> if someone wants to call, what's the phone number there? Um, it's 603-733-5955. All right, so that's food. Let's talk about getting jiggy. 
Uh, mm -hmm. Shark Martin this Thursday? Shark Martin this Thursday. Um, they are one of the biggest bands in the Mount Washington Valley. Um, and they know how to get down. They play something for everyone. Mm. So whether you are, you know, a fresh 21 and looking to get out there or you are in your 60s, they have something for everyone to listen to. Um, and they are by far one of my favorite bands up here. So. Yeah. And uh, one of our hosts that we've been doing some, uh, some videography with went there for her first time a while ago and we got her some food. She's like, you know what? I didn't even realize they had food here because I just have been going here to dance like every Thursday mm -hmm. night. Thursdays are popular. Yeah. So. so that is happening this Thursday. Uh, mm -hmm. You guys basically have music every Thursday. Every Thursday at 9 o'clock. Um, and our kitchen closes at 9, so usually a lot of people come a little bit earlier. Um, grab some dinner in the bar and then they'll stay for the music, which is always kind of a good thing. Uh, get a nice bass for your drinking. Yep. Um, but yeah, music every Thursday. We're also doing um, music on Wednesdays for Meisters. Yep. So we don't have music this Wednesday because there's no Meisters um, for vacation week, but normal Wednesdays from 6 to 9. Um, and we offer buy one, get one half off apps Ooh, those days as well. Delicious. Fried so, calamari? Fried calamari, mm. wings, nachos, whatever your pleasure is. Nice. Uh, also, music on Saturdays. Music on Saturdays at 9. We uh, put, it's not a full band. We do an acoustic act. So it's much more mellow. You can come in and have a drink, listen to some music. You know, you don't have to worry about, you know, a, the dance floor being crowded or getting pushed around. So it's nice. And then if there's one day of the year you want to be at McGrath's Tavern, you could probably guess it's St. Patty's Day. St. Patty's Day. What's coming up St. Patty's Day? Um, so we go all out on St. Patrick's Day. It is by far our busiest day of the year. It is uh, green beer and Guinness and sometimes some jello shots. And uh, we just have a great time. Um, Shark Martin, again, will be playing. They usually play all our big events. Um, so they go on at 9 o'clock. But we'll be serving up corned beef and cabbage all day, um, and we open at 3.30 that day. So, oh, nice. you know, once you, uh, once you get, get going with everybody, um, last year we did have a line, so my suggestion is to get there early. Um, we always have promos going on, so we'll have, you know, the Bud Light promos and the Guinness promos and the Jameson promos. Mm. So Lots of promos. Yeah. You, well, you sound busy, so we're going to get you out of here. No and problem. And our show's about to end, so we have no, no problem. choice. Well, I'm glad you guys had me on. <laughs> Caitlin McGrath, McGrath's Tavern. Seriously, folks, you got to check it out while you're in the White Mountains. And we'll be right back to finish up. I think we're going to squeeze in one more Watch and Win and the Adventure Game when we come back.